What's up everyone? Welcome back to another Geyser tutorial brought to you by Jeremy Guzman. Uh, so today is really cool. We're launching the Geyser Beehive V2 and in fact it's live right now. So this demonstration is just to serve as a quick uh, brief on how to withdraw your Uniswap tokens from the Geyser Beehive V1 and then migrate them over to the V2. And then on top of that, I'm just gonna get go over a few stats um, for how the Beehive V2 is gonna happen. So first and foremost, let's go to the article and pretty much the v, uh, Beehive V2 summary, 1% uh, of the total ample supply will be added to the Beehive V2. Uh, the start date is obviously today. And then the distribution schedule will be um, throughout 90 days. So. How it goes is going to abide by the same um, staking schedule as the pilot and Beehive V1. So the longer you keep your Uniswap tokens in the geyser, the more uh, the higher uh, reward multiplier will become, which means uh, you'll, in essence, earn more ample rewards the longer you keep it in. So as you can see here, if you stake for one month, your reward multiplier will 2x. And then if you stake for two months, your reward multiplier will increase to 3x. And then 3x is the is the cap. That's the highest it will ever go, right? So we'll go back to the geyser. Let's go to the top left-hand corner where you can see ETH Ample. And we're going to go to Beehive V1 Uniswap. If you're already staking in the geyser Beehive V1, just go ahead and click Withdraw. I'm going to withdraw my max supply or my max uh, amount deposited. Click withdraw. And then they're going to give you this quick confirmation page saying, hey, if you leave, you have one more month to get to 3x, and then you're eligible to accrue an additional x amount of ample, right? So I'm going to go right ahead and click withdraw anyway. As you can see, the gas fee is like extremely high right now. So I highly recommend going to ETH gas station dot info and just abide by those um recommendations on, on gas fees but for this demonstration i'm just gonna go ahead and pay the gas fee so click confirm and just like that guys i have successfully withdrew um from the beehive v1 and i have successfully claimed 121 ample reward so you're going to notice that when you withdraw your your uniswap token so i'm going to close that and let's go ahead once this loads as you can see I no longer hold any Uniswap Ample V2 tokens in the Geyser V1. So let's go to the top left-hand corner and go to Beehive V2 Uniswap. Let's go to deposit, and you can see my wallet balance is uh, is showing how much I hold in the uh, ETH Ample V2 Uniswap token. So I'm gonna deposit the maximum amount, hit deposit, The geyser is going to ask for permission to spend a Uniswap V2 token, so that's pretty standard. Again, I, I'm going to uh, say that the gas fees are extremely high. As you can see here, it's $3.91. Um, that's a pretty stupid amount of, of gas fees, but um, no worries. Click confirm. So once the transaction is confirmed, you're going to have to just pay another gas fee, and this is the actual depositing fee. So you'll start participating in the geyser uh, Beehive V2. So Again, I highly recommend going to ETH gas station to see what's the most economic uh, price for you if you're ball on a budget. Um, and then you just go ahead and put in the gas price that fits your budget and then you can go right ahead and go, go with that. So just go ahead and click confirm. And just like that guys, the deposit has been successful. I am now participating in the new Beehive V2 uh, geyser. Um, this is just a quick brief on how to migrate your coins over from the V1 to the V2 and just like that, just to get you guys participating once again. Um, there's a lot of cool stuff going on in Ampleforth, a lot of cool uh, upcoming uh, launches. So I hope you guys are staying tuned. Again, if you have any questions, go ahead and drop it in the comments below. If you have any suggestions for future uh, videos, go right ahead and give me your recommendations in the comments as well. I'm going to be dropping an article discussing a uh, step-by-step -step how to go through this as well. So look forward uh, to that on the Ample Talks forum. With that being said, guys, thanks for watching. See you next time.